Once again, my gang and I have given Inspector Carmelita Fox the slip. I'm really mad I had I to start so late. Well Finally, the secret I wanted to be alive like two hours ago. These years. With this, I could avenge my family and regain possession of our most valued treasure. It all began when I was just a kid, bouncing on my father's knee. Are right, we gonna you figure see, out? I come from a long line of master thieves who kept all their secrets of sneaking and stealing. How are we gonna use book. this? The Thievius Raccoon. When is it going to be appropriate? Anyone who read it learned to be especially sneaky, which is why we specialize in stealing from criminals. After all, there's no honor, no challenge, no fun stealing from ordinary people. You rip off a master the criminal, emo. and you know you're a master thief. Well, on the night I was supposed to inherit the book, five visitors came unannounced to our door. My father fought to protect us, but the gang of villains known as the Fiendish Five overpowered him and ransacked our house until they found the Thievius Raccoonus. Our family's manual of thieving greatness fell into their filthy hands. They tore the book into five pieces and split it up, each villain disappearing to the farthest corners of the world to commit dastardly crimes. Broken alone, I was dumped at the town orphanage. There are two guys who became my lifelong buddies and trusted crew. <laughs> Bentley, techno okay. genius and strategist supreme. Ed Murray, part-time driver. Whenever you fuck up. Together we pledged to track down it's the like, thievish fire, reset. avenge my father, and steal back the thievious raccoonus. I knew I was about to face the toughest test of my <laughs> life. On this mission, I would either become a master thief like my ancestors before me, or fail and allow my family name to bite the dust. That was a nice piece of work back there at police headquarters, Sly. Come see me if you want to check out any of your old movies. I've got them all here on my computer. I've got them all here Use on my the computer. Use the analog stick to move around the hideout and the X button to select things. I've already I've already plotted our next target. The road trip gave me the time I needed to study up on Sir Raleigh the Frog. As a young man, this hot-tempered frog oh, grew bored of his life of luxury and privilege. On a whim, he tried his hand at a bit of piracy and found it to his liking. Raleigh, who quickly became addicted to crime, was brought into the Fiendish Five as chief machinist, where his evil tinkering genius rose to new heights. The last reported sighting of this mad machinist was off the soggy coast of the Isle of Wrath, a small island uncomfortably situated in the middle of the perilous Welsh Triangle. There we go. Memes. God damn it. Sign, please. There we go. A misery be panda king, frog, angry bird, and puppy. Death. Yes. <laughs> That is, or whose meme account that is, rather. I really said that sign dick me, cause like, that, that's cutscene skip, and the out of bounds was like beautiful.
change your name. Wait, it's not just a meme account, it's like an actual name change. I would why? It's like such a waste of a name change. Now you're stuck with that for 60 months or 60 days. I mean like I guess I I commend you for the commitment. I forgot there was a cutscene here. Butter girl, thank you for the host. Also, thank you for the host, Kyle. I didn't say anything. They prefer to say something because I was playing the game. Thank you guys both for the host. Hello, how are you doing? Thank you for the good luck as well. I hope today has been of an acceptable. Uh, acceptable, I guess, likedness. I don't know. English is difficult. Ho ho ho! Get fucked. Also, thank you for the host as well, Ted. Retired because you streamed for six and a half hours earlier? Yeah, I seen that you were streaming, but I was out and about. So I didn't want to stop in on the very limited data that like four people in my household share. I could have at least stopped in and said hi, I guess, though. really hard to avoid the cutscene, or avoid the cutscene, avoid the spot level instead of just waiting for like a normal human being would, that I went too far out and couldn't save myself. Rip. Rip all my time save. Finished off Life is Strange, nice. You're out of data? RIP. That sucks. Temperature's raining way off the charts in here. This must be the power source for the storm machine. Oh, 
be excited about Kyle. There's like three people in chat right now, Kyle. Ted's on mobile. card nice damn I thought I knew how to do that I guess I don't rip yeah mobile as well do speedrun streams nice fucking hype I will attempt to be in there if I can be At least the first one. So far, so good. I bet if you stayed still inside the barrel, the guard would be able to see you, even if he shines his flashlight on you. Nice. Nice, dude. Played that perfectly. He can shoot PC. Time to build Ted a PC, guys. Ted Arena, that PC Arena. I had a feeling I was gonna mess this up. You hear? Yeah, that sounds about right. <laughs> Got it like that yet? Trying to do it a faster way, would save two, then miss pipe jump. Yeah, whatever. It's fine. First job. Promoting that cargo last night. You, the crown jewel of my operation. Fucking hate Raleigh. I love Raleigh, but I hate Raleigh. jump and then getting hit by that guard loses exactly 32.1 seconds. Good to know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Getting well at all. I kinda know how to pronounce that, but I don't want to try it while I'm playing fish. So hopefully it'll still be in the chat so I can attempt to pronounce it, because I've heard it said many a time before. I'm already saying it in my head. I'm probably gonna butcher the shit out of it, but I have a general understanding of how to pronounce that word or that phrase. I have no fucking idea what it means.
Fuck you, crabs. Eat it, Dirk. How's your collection today? What do you mean, collection? I just tried to square boost that. I think I was playing Sly 2. This is why we don't watch Gnist for four hours when we're supposed to be sleeping. Because <laughs> then we try to square boost in Sly 1. <laughs> Alright. Um, voulez vous coucher avec moi? Oh, wait. Fuck. Alright. Voulez-vous coucher avec moi? There we go. I think that's close. The phrase I had in my head went a little bit longer than that, but whatever. Pretty, yeah, that's, that's what I think as well. Considering where I've heard it before, that that makes a lot of sense. Something similar to that, at least. Also, what's up, Jokey? How's it going, man? I got it a long time ago. What? What the fuck? Raleigh. Raleigh, please. That is slow. Fucking frog. I hate you. All oh, frog is better than you. How does it make you feel, huh? Fucking twitchy mode's better than you. And go long, look at your face. Fucking frog. That was really close. I almost fucked that up. <laughs> you like to sleep with me according to Google I Translate? Word. We're all set to go. Good, how about you? Um pretty alright. Pretty alright. It had been a while since Not I've been back going to lie. Next up, the notorious mugshot. Ruthless muscle of the fiendish five. Yeah, not even gonna try Jones, to pronounce he that. Definitely made up for in bronze. Turns out he wasn't always that way. He grew up as the run of the litter. <laughs> a neighborhood weakling. The only friends he could turn to were usually found on the big screen. It was there that he spotted his first gangster, and he knew instantly that that's what he wanted to be. He spent the rest of his youth working real hard to get there. Fueled on his dreams I like of the mode already. With enough perspiration, he realized that dream. He'd become a hard-boiled, street brawling, tough as nails gangster, ensuring that he'd never be kicked on or pushed around again. So he's holed up in Mesa City, huh? I've always wanted to go to that thriving American boom town. Okay. <laughs> Alright, Growl. Have fun, man. Good luck on the runs. If that's what you're doing. I guess I should just say good luck with the stream then. But thanks for the good luck and thanks for uh, stopping by and saying hi, dude. So I don't know if I acknowledge it yet or not, but gotta love when things are even more lewd. Lewdness makes the world go round.
please. <laughs> it's true, but still. <laughs> If you know it's true, then why are you trying to hide it, hmm? If you truly believe in the lewd, why do you never let it take over thy so- Oh god, I need to stop. Right, so, we're done with that. <laughs> you don't know my life. Because it's not usually lewd. Too bad. Good chalky milk. We'll go get you some chalky milk, motherfucker. You're an adult. You can get chocolate milk when you want to get chocolate milk, damn it. Let's go, Sly. Okay, you can just casually shoot through Murray there. <laughs> like, like, okay. So I think this card spawns here. Yeah, it spawns there. And this one spawns over here. And there's one over here. And there's one down here. Alright. Don't get paid for seven hours. Well, whose fault is that to not have a constant supply of chocolate milk at the ready, Kyle? Almost said your last name. So no cutscene glitches today, right? I'm assuming you mean, uh, like crashes and shit. And so far, no, because this is the first run. And hopefully no more beyond this. <laughs> I've linked my Facebook. <laughs> also, what's up, avoided cat? How's it going, man? Oh god! What do you want? Tell me this shit's not funny. It's alright. Fucking works. That's awful. Doing good, that's good. Good to hear. Nice job, like people yeah, here yeah. like you. Kyle, shut up. There's a person sitting right next to me that likes you, and there's an animal on the ground that likes you. And I'm actively the streamer, so. Oh god. Alright. We stopped being bad, chat. We stopped being bad. Right. Please stop. God damn it. I hate you. Why must you do this? Why must you be this way?
Kyle. Check your Snapchat, apparently. If you haven't already. Mean Girl style. <laughs> oh, I can't skip this. Murray, what's going on down there? Unskippable well, cutscenes. Your phone is like over there. Nice, very descriptive. Thanks for that, man. I appreciate that. Three times around the track for a key. It's all you, man. Drive the van with the left analog stick. And if you manage Are you to okay? get your power ups, you can get a boost by pressing the square button. Go get them. I'm on it. Was it like a new teaser for episode 8 or something? Okay. It'll be okay, I promise. Yo, what's up, Alec? How you doing, man? Hope everything's going good. Also, welcome back, Ted. Yeah, we don't we don't talk about the things Kyle says. So God, man, orchestra dog is super far ahead. What? can pretend that they've never met before because she was like four when he left her. I mean, you know, if, if that's who, you know, left her there, but yeah, you know, whatever. not my fault. It's not my fault. I try, okay? I try. God. You see my father? He can grow a mustache, but like, that's it. And like, a weird whack goatee. What? What? Where my attack? Ah, oh, whatever. I don't care. Hi, Boone. Night. Oh, come on. <sighs> really? There was so much time on the split. It's not even funny. Two hundred seventy-five dollars. Ted, what the hell did you buy? It required you to spend that much money. Why don't you get some chocolate milk? <laughs> Your Snapchat died. Eh, it's whatever. I don't think she's gonna send you anymore because she left finally, or she left rather. Not finally. That's rude. Your collection to what collection? I, I don't remember. <laughs> also, I figured out how to do that without like messing it up ever again, so we did it, chat. 
God damn it, why did I get turned around? I guess I just didn't swing my cane fast enough, whatever. It's fine. Let's make up some time later. There's like... There's 24 seconds there of time save, because I messed up all that stuff. And then there's also like another easily like 45 in the gold there, like for free. Just from doing that skip correctly, first try. Starts with a K. I'm so confused. This is gonna suck. Fucking just had to ledge grab, didn't I? Oh, I still hit the cycle, so that's fine. As <clears throat> long as something good happened. Just the cannons with an E. I have no fucking clue. Like zero clue whatsoever. Collection? I'm assuming you collect knives then at this point. Yuck, and these rooftops are filthy. Well, they are I didn't think that was you that collected the knives. Since my locator tells me it's in a jewel case somewhere near Mugshot. Well, 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 look who just walked into my Zendetted. process. <laughs> Sly Trooper. About time you showed up, Miss Fox. Was getting worried about you. I thought you took a wrong turn somewhere back in Paris. The only one making wrong turns is you, Sly. I'd suggest you surrender before I paralyze you with my good friend, the shock pistol. Now see, a girl whose best friend's a firearm's got issues. A little dinner, a little dancing. I think I can help you out. Mm, sounds stop. romantic. <laughs> as long as you don't mind dining in jail. Nah, I hear the service is lousy. Once I catch you, do you'll this know time? for yourself. I don't know. What did you do? Oh god, I'm not gonna make that jump. Fuck me momentum, and I can't, like, skip this death animation because if I load the game, I have to watch the cutscene again. <sighs> Fuck me, dude. I mean, it's fine. It has, like, literally, like, 20 seconds at most. That's not, like, the big deal, but... It's still annoying that it had to happen, nonetheless. I don't know why that's so difficult for me to do without moving the camera. I never thought to do that. Like, ever. As a kid, as a young adult, or as a teenager, then as a young adult, like, I'd never once thought about doing that until I seen Charo do it and that shit blew my fucking mind. Down, you can't run Social media you have is Twitch, YouTube, and Discord? Weirdo. I'm not even a 20 second death. Oh my god! people please I feel when like you literally like someone like asks you a question right they're like you like you, like, you say you found a book right you found a book and you were like I'm gonna put this book with the rest of my books okay and You organize your books by series, okay? So you get a book, you put your you organize your books by series, and you put it with the rest of that series, right? And then someone comes up to you and says, um, "Where'd you put that book at?" 
right after you've told them the name of the book. Where the fuck do you think I put it, genius? No, it was it's hypothetical. I didn't actually get a book today. It was the hypothetical thing to like explain a situation, right? Like, I bought book A. I put A with B, C, and D, right? And then I told you that I bought book A, and you know that I put A with B, C, and D. And then you come to me and you're like, "Well, where did you put A? Where the fuck do you think I put it? Where did I tell you I was going to put?" Ah. So pardon me there. Fable Haven series? No. I told you I didn't get a book. <laughs> Today at least. My mother was nice enough to give me the first four books of the uh, Guardians of Gahul series though. Yesterday? Two days ago. Yesterday or two days ago? We found the first four at a thrift shop. They were like a dollar to get them, so she was like, I'm gonna get these for you, because I know you really wanted to read these again at some point. Also, we could have golded that by like seven seconds, and the fact that I didn't gold that by seven seconds really makes me mad. Because, like, ah, so easy. I, figured out I just messed it up. I goofballed it. The third member of the Fiendish Five was the infamous voodoo priestess, Ms. Ruby. Yeah, kid, okay, it's Born right. into a family cool. of mystics, other children found her scary. Teaching herself to summon the undead provided what few friends she had. A career in crime allowed an adult Ms. Ruby to punish the world for fearing her as a child. Chief mystic for the Fiendish Five, her powers allowed them to break both the laws of man and nature at the same time. Yet despite the whirlwind success of her youth, she managed to slip into obscurity. Last known sightings claim she headed out of civilization and deep into the Haitian jungle. Alright, did I miss a bunch of chat stuff? Uh countless subs videos. Which protection she don't actually exist. <laughs> Alright, I'm back, Chad. I had to reply to a million a million things. And play the game. So I apologize for not speaking very much in the last couple of minutes. You know, that's why all of you are here. To listen to me ramble on about pointless shit. No! Do you guys see the charm, like, fall out of the world? That was cool. Might have to go back and highlight that. It was kind of neat. Just seeing the charm fade from existence. <laughs> I collected too many, too many coins and got a gold charm before I could get to it. I'm fairly certain if you get a gold charm while you collect a charm, like you get two charms at the same time, one just like bounces off of you and just kind of sits there and you can keep trying to collect it, but like nothing will happen so you can like juggle it. I think. I'm not too sure though. Also, Galad hype. All of the glods. Am I gonna probably get another glod here? The voodoo vibe is dark tonight. You all keys, gross Swainsy, please.
Cliff. So what's up, Swinzy? How are you doing? That jump is the easiest thing in the world. Please start learning it. Like, oh, it pains me that people just pass up two free seconds. Like, you don't have to go for it if you don't have a charm if you don't want to, because I understand losing the run for two seconds is not worth it. But, like, if you have a charm, it's fucking, like, six seconds if you miss if you mess it up. Like, there's no reason to just not go for it, and it's really not as difficult as it, like, feels like it should be. Just play around with it for a bit, and you'll get it every time. Easy peasy. Being really greedy for fish right here at the start, for whatever reason, because there's like so many that just keep spawning in front of me. I just feel like I have to go for the fish and like light a couple torches. And it keeps juking me. Which isn't good. This is not how you fish correctly, by the way. Supposed to always be moving near unlit torches and grabbing fish along the way, not just constantly lighting one or two torches and then moving to where fish spawn, even if they're like like a clump of fish can look appetizing or appetizing can look correct to go for. But if you're gonna waste more time going for it than you would just by like trying to light a torch or two and then moving on with your life, it's not worth it. So see, I didn't beat this gold here, and this gold is. This gold's good, but it's not 132 good. Fishes. Also, you're well, man. It's good. It's good to hear. Zen fishing tutorials. <laughs> I, mean, I guess. I get it's technically a tutorial on how to fish, but. It's not really like a tutorial, it's more like, it's more like fish lessons with Zen, right? We sit down, we have a casual chat, you know what I mean? I talk about how to squish fish with your little, like, swamp rover and turn them into oil so you can light torches. Nice, dude, backup strats. I love getting backup strats, because I never get backup strats. I don't understand what that jump was off of that second ledge grab. It's like a slope grabbed, or a slope jumped against nothing, but it fucked me, so... Whatever. Ted is a bot. <laughs> So we're gonna, like, unless I play this really solidly, ah, uh, I could've went for that. I'm ashamed that I didn't go for that. Um, unless I, like, play super god tier here, we're gonna lose a couple seconds of time save. Cause, like, I can beat this gold by eight or so seconds by playing really solid. But, you know, I have to play really solid. Which can be hard to do in this level. Yeah. <sighs> Please don't knock me all the way down here. Good. Oh, come on with the long ass animation. Please. Oh, I'm all the way back here. Or sly with fucking like whatever. Alright, it's fine. This level went absolutely horrendously, but meh. Doesn't really matter that much. 
it's like 20 seconds, I could care less than 5 minutes ahead of my PB, like... Fuck it. Like, who in all actuality really, really cares that much? Cool. <laughs> So displaced, they get stuck in the wall. Nice. I'm doing that because I want at least one charm and I can't get a charm. Oh, that sucks. And it actually wasn't even 20, 20 seconds. Or, oh no, it was about 20. Five and then three and a half is a little bit more than how long a key animation is. That vehicle seems to be outfitted with some sort of high energy cannon. Use the left analog stick to move and aim the right analog stick in the direction you want to shoot. Remember, you can always shoot in one direction while moving in another. So if you're wondering when I was going to lose this charm, I'm going to lose it up here. Try to make this area go as quickly as possible. I'm making it so the ghosts don't spawn, because they don't spawn after you take damage for like 5 seconds. It's a little bit slower. Than normal, and I would have, I still would have golded that by a couple seconds if I would have just exited level instead of loading the game to get my charms back. <coughs> but it makes that ending part the easiest. So you know. I just sent you a text to pick attached. I'm scared to look at it because it cost them 750. Probably just like console or PC or something. So you heard all over what's going on, Rick. And yeah, the run, the run is really good. But my PB for all keys isn't good. So I mean, it's like it's hard to beat this time. But considering how far ahead of it I am, this is actually pretty good, so... This chickens is going pretty awfully, though. Every time I go for a chicken, I miss it, and then a rooster spawns, so I can't, like, take a second shot at it. I'm probably gonna lose time here. Not lose time, but not save as much time as we have to save. I'm gonna haunted house bash tables for fear for hand. Fair enough. Fair enough. Now 
hour until the store opens? Huh? I guess it is a little bit later slash early for you than I normally start. Did you at least have fun, Rick, despite, you know, bashing your hand too much? Did you at least have fun? Let's a cool look at it. <laughs> Maybe he bought a new car or something, and then a car. <laughs> 750, not 7500. I'm assuming it's just like a computer or something. Most concerned how good your timing is? No, Rick. Do you want to know someone who has perfect fucking timing? For the past, like, four or five streams that Kyle's been here, um, because we're friends in real life, he has me added on Facebook, and literally every time that I, like, I'm literally about to press the button to go live, Kyle sends me a uh, message on Facebook like, Hey man, are you getting ready to go live? Or what's, what's going on tonight? <laughs> Every fucking time. I swear I will send you screenshots of the Facebook messages without fail every time I'm about to start the stream. <laughs> Spent all day darkening in a room. Just some asshole opened it up. Wow. What a dick. Or a bunch of dicks, I'm assuming. I'm assuming it wasn't the same asshole, because, like, he'd probably get kicked out at that point. Unless he was, you know, working there. In there, I, I can imagine. Smoke machine nearly gassed us. <laughs> That's always good. Glass sword, nice. <laughs> At least like look good. Not like a oh this is a glass sword I'm gonna like break it by stepping on it, but like oh hey it's an actually really good and well crafted blade. Well not a blade, but you know what I mean. Doesn't seem effective, but I want to see it. Yeah, and glass swords are not very effective. It does look dope. All right, well that's good. I mean obviously it has no practical use, but like. That's not the point of a glass sword, it's meant to be decorative. But so long as it looks cool as fuck. And it doesn't realistically matter now, does it? So I was kind of slow on my menuing there, because I didn't want to lose the run to having to do our entire boss fight over again. By mashing X too fast. One time home defense. <laughs> You got a piece of paper? No fucking way! <laughs> Yo, we got a piece of paper! Sweet gold, dude, Rick. This has been the run of gold. Born penniless, he was One, two, by the three, four, five, six, seven golds, and there's been at he least like two I've missed by like a second to just being bad. But when he tried to offer his fireworks to the nobleman, they couldn't see past his shabby clothes and chased him away. Humiliated, the Panda King took revenge on those who shunned him by using the very tools of his art for crime. The Fetish Five recruited him as their demolitions expert, and from then on, his explosive touch became feared worldwide. Feel. When you don't understand why someone you've never talked to for an exceptionally long period of time is just like randomly, constantly, like, Trying to talk to you, in a way.
I wonder if I should engage them in conversation. Can't talk about cool things and not share. Post in Discord. If you make your best possible, you'll beat Pickle. Yeah, Pickle has like a 123 something, right? For all keys. I want to know if my sum of best is below, uh, it's below 120 now. Cause I've had a couple like really big golds. So I'm curious. I could always just check, like, you just stop being a lazy prick and just mouse wheel it at some point. 12331, word. Yeah, it could have been slightly better, but it's fine. I didn't get hit, so like half a second I lost here to being unoptimal, I can save tenfold. So. Dude, this is the vault, but you need more clues. It's weird seeing that coin number be 32. I'm also concerned, because I don't think I'm going to have- I'm not going to collect enough coins to have a charm for Clockwork Jump. So I might have to detour and spend like 25 seconds collecting the charm and Duel by the Dragon. And then saving to keep it, and then like loading the game to get it back. So I'm like 90% certain that that works. I would like to have a charm for the end game. Not even Clockwork Jump alone, but like the entirety of the end game. It's just really difficult and I would like a charm for it, if at all possible. So I might have to make a slight detour. So that feeling when your PV is really bad, but like... It has, a re has two golds back to back at the start of World 4. I'm beginning to get flashbacks of this run, and if I remember correctly, my World 4 is god tier. Also, what an obnoxious point to have like a half a second of audio delay. What a very, very obnoxious point for that to happen. Oh god, that's so annoying. I don't know how, like... I guess audible is the best way to say that. It is for you guys watching, but playing... God, is it the most annoying thing ever? In a level where everything is based on sound? Luckily, I can try to fix that. Right here. That did not help. I think it, in fact, only made it worse. Feels like it's a full second now. Well, actually. That seems alright. Fuck. Let's 
see here. Eh, about a half a second delay now. Also that feel when you beat your two golds in your PB in a row by just holding them both in a row. Like, easy fucking easy, I guess. Welcome back, Ted. I imagine my phone beeping, or not beeping, but vibrating was you having posted the thing I'm a Bob in Discord. This looks like a place to try out your new invisibility move. Hold down the circle. So what is this card's cycle? So weird. While invisible, nothing can see you. Not lasers, not searchlights, not guards. Oh, and if the guards already see you, then the invisibility trick won't work. Okay, which Discord did you put it in? Oh, I didn't think I was going to make it. Thief net? There's Kyle not in Thief net. Not Kyle's in Thief net. Golden that by a couple seconds and instead I lost six, whatever. I don't care. It's fine. I will check it in the Panda King reset. Also, I can reset. Reset. I can gold this by, uh, by a bunch. Also, yeah. Remember my trend of me saying that my episode 4 was godlike? Yeah, this was the only level that wasn't. I literally had instant spinning in my PB. <coughs> I, had instant I golded, I think, four segments in here on my PB. So, yeah. <laughs> The fact that I have managed to only lose four seconds against this godlike world four. It's actually really solid. And I'm actually gonna save a whole bunch of time here, because this was the A the only level that went bad to my knowledge. And like I can gold it again by doing the guard skip that I did. Alright guys, <laughs> yeah fuck it, let's just see how it goes, not even gonna say anything, acknowledge that, we're just gonna do it. And look at that, 106 flat. Ah, oh, it's so pretty. Also, I kind of just want to like not get this charm because it's gonna take. It's gonna like I can gold this by like fucking 10 seconds. Like, I really want to gold it by 10 seconds. But at the same time, like, being safe. 
Also, I ledge grabbed there, and I totally thought I was going to fucking hit the cutscene, and I was about to be really sad. Alright, so that's probably like 10 or so seconds. I don't know, I wasn't actually looking at the timer when I grabbed the charm. And I'm like 90% certain that that'll work. Because this game is really poorly designed. So saving something that you've grabbed in a level, even if you lose it in that level, will still let you keep it. Yeah, ho what is up, Slight and Dota? How the hell is it going, my man? Nice, and we got this first try. We might still gold this, which is sad. Oh, hey, Carmelita. Just go ahead and casually have your bullet track me. Also calculated. This is the world four. To be all world fours. Yeah. This is like literally a god tier world four in my PB. Like it like it lost the ten seconds to not being a two thirty here, which I'm not gonna actually gold here. It lost the, the ten seconds to not being like a two twenty three, two twenty four. And then it lost like third seconds and flame and enemy flame, but other than that, like this world four was fucking god tier. Even my Panda King only lost like two seconds. My race skip was basically a gold. If only this was any percent. I mean if this was any percent I'd probably be behind. How did my world three go? Yeah, I lost like 20, yeah, my, I would have lost 30 seconds in Descent into Danger. Lost 5 here, I would have lost like 12 here. These two splits were fine. Um, I lost a whole bunch of time across these two splits. Yeah, this actually would have been really fucking solid for any percent. I would have maybe lost like 30 seconds, not 30, but like 45 over the course of World 3 and 4, provided that like Free Skip and Panda King go well. Which is always the, the chance that like I can just mess this up. Like that, because I boosted way too fucking early. Finally got everything. Start running Sly, nice dude, nice. Oh, so that was a really wonky way to get race skip, but I'll fucking take it. <laughs> Start looking into the, getting in some, some runnings, some practice and shit. It's always good. Also, thank you for the host slight. I appreciate it, man. As always. All right, let's reset this here console. Although, Ted, I missed Pipe Jump, so actually I wouldn't have even been here. Because <laughs> I missed Pipe Jump when I did it. Yo, that sword is actually dope as fuck. If that's like actually the sword he got, that's really fucking cool. Not gonna lie, I'm a little jealous. I was playing Planet Coaster, oh god. Start is the button you mash for yourself. Please don't forget to do that. There you go. Later, Ted. If you're actually leaving, if you're joking, um, see you later, Ted. <laughs> Yeah. Right. 
2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Never leave my Zen Zen. Oh god, please stop. Okay, partner. We were on our way to the Krakarov volcano in Russia. While looking over what little information I had on the final member of the Fiendish Five, I began to notice something. In the four parts of the Thievius Raccoonus recovered so far, several of the pictures depict a shadowy owl like figure, which looks very similar to the police images of the mysterious clockwork. Is this a strange coincidence, or is there something I'm missing? This cutscene's really short. It's only like 40 seconds long. Like with the load-ins and load-outs, it's like 45 seconds. Cause like 6 of that is menuing, at least. Not even like 10 of that's actually menuing. Cause you load the game and you view map and you go back to the hideout and then you go to press X. Like, fuck. No FFZ. <laughs> well whose fault is that? That's your fault, Ted. Your fault. You can, well, fuck it, I don't know if you have an Android. But if you have an Android, you can get the, like, mediocre mobile app that I've heard that they have, which is probably mediocre because they don't have enough money to, like, make it not mediocre, which is something I should really, like, try to help out with. I really love their service. I would mind helping them out a little bit. I guess a little, little bit that I can't help them out. I can text them to you on Discord. Because <laughs> you ain't getting my number. <laughs> But Kyle, your phone number is so fucking dope. Like, you have literally the coolest phone number in existence. I'm missing the shit out of those mines. Sure, let me have a new number now. Do I have any cool stream alerts, or are you saying that I should totally get them? Because, uh, the answer to the first version of that question is I don't have any, no. Uh, the second answer, or the answer to the second question, is while I think they're nice, um, I don't personally enjoy them too much, and my computer couldn't handle them anyway, and if I did get a new computer, like, Maybe in like the top left corner, that like a little bit of black space that's there would be like a new follower slash like a donor alert, I guess. Um, but I think that's where that could be at, I guess. And then like a sound clip might play. I don't know. I'm not really too big into the, the whole alerts thing. Aw, oh, damn it. I can't believe I missed that one computer. They're literally falling on me. They are literally falling on me. What the fuck is this RNG? Holy shit. They are straight up just fucking landing on me. at the end there. Like, that was a really good computers, and I just kind of ruined it. Alright, cool. I see the PM, Kyle. Just refund my donation. And, well, 
Wait, did you actually send one, Dota? Oh, holy shit. That's what the email is from. Yo, thank you. <laughs> also gotta skip that, because I missed splitting. I felt my phone vibrate. And I looked down and seen that I had an email. And I just automatically assumed it was like a new follower. Oh, that was it. That was the that was the launch. It's okay, cause so was that one. Um, Slighten, if you'll still be around when the run is over, I can check that and like read if you uh, if you put a message in or whatever. I would have done it right there, but I kind of skipped the cutscene. I, I get any and all cutscenes for the rest of the game we skip, and like the rest of the end game is very skill intensive. Got hours, brah? Alright, fair enough. Yell at me though if I don't at least like look at it after I beat Clockwork up. I guess I could have like opened up everything here at least so I could have it ready. Yo! <laughs> nice. Also, nice Kyle, I'll put that in my, is my new. You know, how long have you had the new number, Kyle? Like, have you had that for, like, a very long time? And by a very long time, I mean at least six months. Like, three months? Okay. That explains at least, like, half of the text messages I've sent you. What? What? <sighs> okay. Whatever. Alright, cool. Gotta love your inputs getting eaten. <sighs> that sucks. Hopefully I can still sub Mickle. My PB, which is subsequently my gold, uh didn't do the clockwork jump. That jump looks like it only, or that fail looks like it only cost me 20 seconds. So it looks like it should still be fine. Also, I'd like to shout out uh, twitch.tv slash a pack of crayons for the strat to skip the first little rung down there on the spinny things. You can totally just straight up double jump over the first and second one, or the first one, and just go straight to the second one. You can also do that from the second one to the fourth one. Oh, wait, it's not my gold. Oh, fucking rip, dude. I can't sub Mickle anymore. Fuck me, man. That sucks. Rip, dude. Unless I, like, god tier the shit out of this. Like, I have to be super fucking optimal. For a few of the zappy things. Well, I found out about it through Crayons. Right, that was a very optimal phase one, like, not even, like, joking. Normally, Clockwork will, like, turn around and face the camera there. So that was probably, like, a second saved. I don't get it. You're so familiar with my family. You must have known my father had a son. If you hated the Cooper so much, why did you let me live when you stole the Thievius Raccoonus? Because I wanted to show the world. Just slain, thank you for the two, uh, the, the two dollars and fifty cents, man. 
I greatly, well, greatly, well, greatly appreciate it. Um, I'm gonna have to pull up this on my phone. So I can check if there's a message or not. But thank you very much, man. I appreciate it. I'm sad that I missed that <laughs> initially. But thank you. I'm not gonna get hit here trying to save save milliseconds like I did in my my one run that was gonna PB for any percent by like 10 seconds or something. Oh, I, I didn't even realize I got the setup for that. Yo, I feel when you get purple ringed and don't die. Feels feels really fucking good, man. Alright, shoot the... Uh, I don't want you to shoot the left one first. Go... Oh, left, middle, right, middle? That sucks. It's kind of bad. Char doesn't even play the game, he just skips it. <laughs> Alright, hopefully that was enough to save 12 seconds or something. Nah, I'm not gonna do it. Ah, uh, I was like a three second gold though. It's not bad. It took some tricky maneuver, it's a very optimal clockwork. Snatch that last piece of the thievious raccoonus from Clockwork's claw. Sad that I died in sinking peril because fucking gave me my input, but whatever. <laughs> Freaking seven seconds. And finally, Clockwork. I'd beat my all <sighs> one by one and reclaim my Nine. Birthright. Yeah, nine, because 31. Of course, there was no way I could have gotten here. Damn you, Mickle, in your nine seconds. I know this hasn't been easy for you. Ah, I wish you were here so I could yell at you. 